Hello guys, welcome back to another one with us, The Review Bros. My name is Aaron and I'm bringing you a new supplement by Clearly Naked Supplements called Naked New Pre-Workout. Let's get into this one guys, an in-depth review right out of here. Strap in all the usuals, taste, price, mixability, label, effects, and that final verdict. Is this product right for you? Okay, let's get into the taste and the mixability of the product. So it comes in three different flavors. Pineapple, watermelon, and the one we have is blue raspberry. So I would have preferred pineapple, but let's let's see how this goes. Oh, that's pretty cool. It is one of those funnel shakers. So if you've only got a water bottle on you, not a shaker, easy to whack in. It's quite a big scoop, guys. 22 grams for that full serve. In she goes. Let's get through this one for you. How does she mix? Small bit of frothing next to nothing. Yeah, pretty good actually. Pretty damn good. Blue raspberry going down, let's do it. That tastes like a blue raspberry that I've never had before. It's very, very unique. Not bad, I'd say it actually tastes more like bubble gum than blue raspberry. Seven out of 10. It's got a funny aftertaste, not bad necessarily. It's very different. It's like a blue raspberry that I've never had before. So seven out of 10 for that effort. Okay guys, let's move into that price factor. So where can you pick it up first and foremost? You can go over to clearlynaked.com where you'll see this in those three different flavors for $41.99. And a massive thumbs up for the reason being, it is a 30 serving container. So you know what, I do like that. It'll work out to be a dollar and 40 per go, which I can tell you guys on our very consistent price scale, it's a seven out of 10. So that is actually, you know, respectable. Definitely, definitely up there in the, in the more, the cheaper end of supplements. UK guys, just for a comparison, it would cost you £32.96 for the tub or only a pound and 10 pence per the serving. So again, seven out of 10 on that consistent pricing scale. So yeah, well priced. Okay guys, let's get into the label for you. So it is one scoop serving, a full 30 serving. So it's a thumbs up straight away there. One scoop weighs 22 grams, so it's more than average guys. And we start off with calcium. Uh, so that's just gonna help with muscular contractions and a bit of energy production. You know, it's a healthy ingredient really. Then we move into the main stuff. So we start off L-citrulline, the pure version at seven grams. So that's gonna boost nitric oxide levels up in the bloodstream guys. It give you a nasty pump, that's a very good dose. Then we wrap into a beta alanine at the clinical 3.2 grams. So that'll give you that beta tingle, that itchy, tingly, almost allergic feeling reaction to let you know the pre-workout's kicking in. Myself and Craig really like that. And it's been shown to boost endurance down the line once it's built up in the system, so good stuff. Then we have three grams of L-arginine, so that'll synergize and work well with the L-citrulline at the beginning there to boost those nitro oxide levels even more. So the pumps should look nasty from this product. Then we have the clinical dose, 1.5 grams of creatine HCL. Now that's often mistaken as creatine monohydrate needing three to five grams, but because it's the hydrochloride version, it digests so much better. So that's effectively the same as getting in your full five of creatine monohydrate. So that's your daily dose there, that's good stuff. Helps with strength, power output, endurance, all the good stuff. And wrapping off this label, you'll see it's a very basic label, guys. 200 milligrams of caffeine anhydrous. So it's a very low stimulant product, guys. A couple of cups worth of coffee, just a bit more than a Red Bull or a Monster Energy drink. Just enough to give you a little bit of kick in the gym. Um, so it's a very compliant label. It's a basic label. It's fully dosed label as in terms of clinical dosages. Nothing's underdosed. Um, I think it'll get the job done, guys. Effects time of this product. So Naked New, what can it bring you? Now there is no denying guys, it is a low stimulant pre-workout. It is absolutely not for stim junkies. And I think the reason being they wanted a, a product that you know would help with muscle gains, productive sessions, and I know that they did uh, formulate this to help with the military as well. So obviously they're not allowed a lot of these hardcore illicit gray area stims. So I absolutely do get where they're coming from and there is definitely a market for it. I'd call it a caffeinated non-stim product. And in such a sense, as in the pumps are very good. They're its strongest element of this product. Pumps were nice and nasty. You know what? 
you get a decent amount of uh, pump product, pump ingredients in this product. So they were the best factor of it. And following, you know what, stims, energy-wise, that was low. There's no denying it. Their focus was quite low as well. But you know what, I, I do get where they're coming from. This would be a product I'd call a very good daily driver product. It's a good 20 gram scoop, so that is a thumbs up. You're getting a, you are getting a lot of bits and pieces in there. The beta alanine was respectable as well. You know what, seven out of 10 on strength. Um, the pump ingredients might have soaked up the, some of the potency there, but the itchy tingle feeling was definitely still apparent. So th that's a thumbs up. You know, myself and Craig, we, we do enjoy that. Energy, it still got me through my session. There's no denying it. It, it. You know what, it's probably just a bit stronger than an energy drink. Um, but like I mentioned, guys, there really is a market for it. So what would I give this on each section? So I'd say that energy probably was around the four out of 10. There's, you know what, I can't deny that. The pumps were probably up the other end at a nine out of 10. And the focus, I felt quite focused. I wouldn't say there's necessarily in anything in here for focus, so it comes down to your own willpower, you know, your own training uh, wheels effectively. Overall, I'm gonna give this product a seven out of 10. Do you know what? I, I can see it being a good product for people who do want productive gains, for people who are, you know, sensitive to stims, especially caffeine. You're getting your 200 milligrams of caffeine, so it is still a couple of coffees worth. So um, there is 100% a market for it. Stim junkies, stay clear. For uh, beginners, it's a thumbs up, definitely. For intermediate people, thumbs up. For people who wanna make gains, definite thumbs up. This would, would be a product I would be happy, take, happy taking every single day um, to, to, to put some muscle mass on, effectively. Some of these high stim ones, they do take away from putting on weight. It's a, it is as simple as that. So uh, a thumbs up to Naked New. It's a, it's a different kind of product. It is one of the lower stim ones, but they're rare these days, so you know what, it definitely has its market. So seven out of 10 to Naked New. Let's roll through this final verdict of this product then, guys. So clearly Naked Supplements have bought us their new pre-workout, Naked New. How did it score? Let's go in the order of the review. So taste. Seven out of 10, we have blue raspberry. I would argue myself, it was completely different from any other blue raspberry. I personally would have called it bubblegum. That tasted more like a bubblegum flavor to myself. Then we move into the price of the product. Again, a respectable seven out of 10, only a dollar and 40 per serving or a pound and 10 pence for you UK guys. So that, you know what, respectable for sure. And the effects, you know what? It's not a stimulant product, a, well, a high stimulant product. It wouldn't touch the sides for people who want strong pre-workouts. However, the audience for this are those who want to put on muscle mass, make some productive gains, those who are sensitive to stimulants, those in the military, you know, there's, there's so many people this would be suitable for. With just 200 milligrams of caffeine, it's a nice little hit of energy. It gets the job done, guys. Um, and I scored that a seven out of 10 as well. So seven across the board for this product giving us that total of 21 out of 30. So that is my synopsis on it, guys. 21 out of 30, good for productive gains, not a stim junkie product. And I just wanna thank you guys for watching along. You know what, it means the absolute world to us. If you haven't already, please do subscribe at this point. Give us the thumbs up on the video. You know, all the good stuff, it really helps us to grow and get more products, which we've got so, so many more coming at you. Let me tell you that, we're getting more by the day. So yeah, stay tuned, guys. Hit that bell icon. You know, comment below, all, the good, all of the good stuff. It means the world. And uh, as always, guys, stay stimmed, or in this case, pumped.